honor to have each one of you here with us today as we celebrate the convergence of technology and potential. As and when the technology comes up, I, I can be uh, at the forefront of uh, using it so that I can be more efficient in my work. Technology is a platform that can help create a level playing field for all. I'm quite sure you saw my profile that you use ChatGPT. <laughs> uh, what type of skill set that ta talents that we are going to have to develop? I think this is where we have to play a part because we have to continue to make the system smarter and train. Now I think we all will agree that it's not future, but generative AI is already here in our life. Generative AI will impact us in three ways. Firstly, it will impact us in terms of how us as individuals live, work and play. Secondly, it will impact the environment and the institutions that we work for. The third thing would be how we engage with others. Also, the people aspect of it, that we want to make sure that uh, people are trained, they are able to work with AI, um, and it's not something that um, is developed and then just uh, put into a corner. You can't differentiate between good and bad since you can't teach AI or tech ethics but, ma but the man who's making the AI can learn ethics. So I think the ability to innovate, uh, to fail forward faster and to learn from our mistakes faster is going to be accelerated as well so that you know we can actually get, as I said, more productive uh, and also go up the value chain. critical that they also understand how uh, tech can be used for good uh, with the skills that they have. We actually saw that uh, Gen AI is influ influencing uh, trends and awareness and uh, vulnerability assessment, uh, stress modeling and scam detection. Really insightful. Uh, now we kind of know where Gen AI is moving towards uh, the future in Malaysia and the impact it is doing also for the people as well as the students and the companies and the industrial uh, collaboration involved as well.